ride feels for you? Uh, I think if I can last another 10 minutes, I'd be winning, right? <laughs> it's, uh, I, don't, I don't get off the horse. That's, I think that's very important. Okay. It's working my core muscles right now. Okay, I'm here with Alex. He's going to put the G-Stat on my wrist. And uh, so what kind of measurements does this take? 34, 24, 32. <laughs> so it's called the G-SAT? It's, it's the G-SAT 618. Okay. And it's basically a GPS device that you would use for running, hiking, biking, and it tracks and logs your trip. Does it log my G-spot? <laughs> well, it might. <laughs> Hi, what's up? What's your name? Uh, my name is Leonardo on Rubio. Okay. Um, so how, is this your first time at CEA? Yeah, first time. Okay. And, yes. and do you do you, what is this product that the, that's sponsoring you? Uh, it's Skull Candy. They're actually it's actually kind of like uh, bags with music in them, and they actually it's it's like higher end bags like hip hop. Okay. Do you use it yourself? Well, I use the headphones right now. <laughs> so yeah. Hi, I'm here with Dick, William, and Jerry. So we have a Dick, a Bill, and a Terry. Close enough. And you're very hairy. What's your favorite dummy book? Women for Dummies? Uh, uh, dating for Dummies. <laughs> dating for Dummies. Yes. Uh, hairstyles for Dummies. There we go. <laughs> Pop it good. <laughs> so, Bill and I have been trying to pick out a set of night vision goggles because we're trying to figure out how we're going to spy on the next Paris Hilton sex tape making. He's trying to help me pick. What do you think of these ones? Uh, they're pretty good, I think. Yeah, so powerful. Can we see from far away? Yeah. How, how does it look? <laughs> I think you can see it in red. Everybody left for Macworld today because they think they're getting the exclusive over there in San Francisco, but they don't. We really have it here. Here is the new iPhone. Wait, I think I hear it ringing. It's vibrating because it's getting closer to my skin. <gasps> Hi, Steve. Thanks so much for the exclusive. Eddie and I really appreciate it. They told us when we came to Las Vegas for CES, everything would be all bling and iced out. They were right. This is real ice, 24 karat ice. Cha-ching. Out! This is how I like to drive. I like to keep all my devices available. Oh, look, I'm getting a phone call right now. Let's see. Hello? Oh, take a left. Take a left at the at the Divix booth and then a right at Seagate. Okay, I'll be right there. Breaker Breaker 19. Anybody got their ears on? Red 4. This is the Roadrunner. Who I'm talking to? This this is Tits McGee. What's your 20? My 20 is at CES. Midland Electronics booth. Well, I'm coming up right there. Let's see if we can find a couple of lot lizards and pull up ourselves a party. Here with Veronica Belmont. Where's your pimp suit? I have to wear mine all day. I made you wear that pimp suit. <laughs> Actually, it is. It's all Veronica's fault. She said, you have to wear that at CES. But I forgot your gold clutch. Oh, damn it. I'm sorry. Listen, you got to let your girls breathe. <laughs> Why are you hiding them? I don't want to keep them in a box. <laughs> How's it going for you? What's, like, the least uh, useful thing you've seen at CES? You know what? I've barely even gotten a chance to walk the floor yet. I've been stuck here behind the booth all day, which is still fun, but I haven't really gotten a chance to see the really cool stuff. The best thing that I heard about though is an R2-D2 projector Ooh. and so it shoots, a, it shoots a projected image out onto the screen from R2-D2's little you know beep 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 beep, beep okay. eyes and it also has a VoIP phone built into it. Hi R2 I'm visiting your bedroom right now so is it okay have you ever had girls up in your room before? Are you are you excited that I'm visiting you? R2, you're getting very fresh. <laughs> I can't believe he just said that. Does your mother know that you talk like that when our girls are around? Okay, R2, so what's the most boring thing you've seen at CVS? The iPod phone? But that's at Macworld. You're going to beat the pants off that Steve Jobs? That's some fighting words there. He's the new Darth Vader? What? You want to make out with me? Oh my god. I think it's time for us to go. Woo! 130 Woo! degrees. 130 degrees. That's so hot. 
I'm here with Michael from Dream Cheeky, and he's going to tell us the truth about his company. What does this do for our computer? Absolutely nothing. Is it? Is it? Is there anything that it, that is useful for? No, it's completely useless. A complete waste of time. Only for fun. <laughs> low technology. <laughs> low tech. Low tech. Okay, Fire let's skills. see. Let's see what it does. It, it's not very good, is it? No, it's <laughs> oh! Wow! Completely useless technology. So I heard that Mickey Mouse got lost at CS. Hello, this is Mickey. I can't find my way. Oh, no. Wait a minute. I'm Tweety Bird. Hi, this is Mickey. He's always faking it out. Gosh, Mickey, can I find you? <laughs> Sorry. Geek Entertainment. You know, That's pretty good. I know. Okay. And I'm really a horror star. I do, like, Stallone, Michael Jackson, Paul McCartney, all those guys. We'll do Stallone. Oh, man, I'm really a horror star. <clears throat> He goes, yo, Adrian, the night I fight Apollo, you know? I'll not fool in. Adrian, sit down. I want to talk to you. Apollo, one more shot. Just give me one more. <laughs> and I'm really a horse. But, um, so what are you doing at CS? Well, actually, I'm doing a show here at the Bellagio. Um, I do about 400 voices. Oh, my God. So I'm doing a private show, and then I just walk through to see some of my friends. So do you do Bill Gates? <laughs> No, I can't. You do I, Steve I know Bill. Jobs. I live on Mercer Island in Washington. <laughs> Don't want Bill mad at me. Oh, come on. We'll, we'll, we'll protect you. We'll protect <laughs> he'll, you. He'll remove my house. We'll protect Literally. you. I could just see, you know, I could just see Dr. Ruth coming in going, Well, you know, Bill Gates, sex is good for you. Better not do it now. You know. <laughs> no, that's okay. Geeky, right? <laughs> so can you do R2-D2? Not now with his voice. <laughs> Trust me. Actually, they can. <laughs> no, right. I'm really hoarse. So, um, but I do a lot of voices, um... Paul McCartney, Michael Jackson, that kind of stuff. And we heard you do some uh, voices inside of cars. Is that true? Yeah, I'm an ADR. I do, like if you saw Finding Nemo, I was one of the the voices, two of the voices for two of the cartoons, Squirt and Crush. Okay. And then Little Mermaid, I did Flounder. Um, Toy Story. Yeah. This would be great for geek. Here's Toy Story. So you can guess who this is. Okay. Ah, oh, the claw is my master. Oh, I am the chosen one. Ah. <laughs> ah, TGM. Oh. That's a good one. <laughs>